Go just scream. Could not have done it without this guy's help. What a cameraman. Come on, big thumbs up for you, Ben. <laughs> what can I say? Fine bit of armor in that was. Anyway, did I get it in the car? Of course I did. Oh, it's windy. Woo! We may say. Well, I think we better bring the bins out a bit. do just fine that because as we all know from this direction she can't see behind them see hardly noticeable however i couldn't get these in the uh the, the house the shed uh it's just one of those hose ends a lot more of those whore whore Hose ends. Can't say that, can I? Hose ends. That's shocking. What are you doing in here? Well, ooh, it's so much warmer in here. I put the fire on as soon as I, as soon as I come in. Had a look at my neighbour's skip uh, just after I offloaded the car. Wasn't much. Some more wood. Some more wet wood. And a handsaw that they threw away. Yeah, the throwaways these are the hard point heat induction. I don't know if you can see it there, how it's coloured heat induction hardened teeth. Uh, not like an old blade. So the rest of the blade is not going to be anything. Anyway, it's iron, isn't it? So the wood we picked up yesterday, we stacked over the top of the fire in, in kind of a, you know, uh, brick type of fashion trying to warm my gloves up because it's the cold and the wet so that's drying which means I need to chop that to size and put there and put that in the fire to be honest right what did we get oh I'm gonna take uh, well as we pass the uh, the computer it's it's Thursday night I don't work Fridays, so I can have a cheeky drink. Uh, McEwen's champion. Why, well, because he's a oh, champion, that's what he says. And I'd better not, mate. I shouldn't really put these two bottles together again, because the last time I made a serious mistake and I ended up having a, a, a glug, glug, glug of that bottle, thinking it was that bottle. And there's a big difference, that being 40%. Anyway, who we're listening to? The sound of young America, Ardeen Taylor. Indiana wants me. Uh, we'll have his playlist on. So, flux capacitor to one side. The bench is not clear at all. I thought, to be honest, I thought my last video I'd nearly done these. And then what happens? I bring a boatload more on. So, never mind, it's all money. It's all money, money, money. Take measure. The walkway's still here, but it's more like horse racing. No, horse racing. Steeple chasing. We have little jumps in between. Shut up. Not for the court the mouse. Where are we? Right. All this aluminium bed off the, the old truck. I'm trying to warm some, trying to warm the pants up. We got soaking wet through its channel. Yeah, I'm gonna say, ooh, five milli thick, easily. Channel measuring four inches across, a hundred mil.
two inch across, 50 mil. Ooh, and quite sicky stuff. I've got to get all that iron out of it though. Otherwise, it'll go in as iony alley. And we don't want any alley where we went to all that omering just to get it here. And it's not all here. I couldn't get it all in. Still some outside. Well we have a saying. If it don't if it don't rain it just pours. So uh that's me. Looks like I've got my work cut out for me this weekend if I pull my finger out on the next hour next few hours tomorrow morning I can get a load together get to the anvil yard uh, brass has gone up a little bit almost reached my target of four pound a kilogram it's three thousand nine hundred and seventy three pound ninety seven for the quantity I've got 50 kilogram I'm gonna lose 50 three pences I'm gonna lose one pound fifty so get it in Ian Thursday night boatload to do not being in and had my tea yet and it's 7 p.m. in the evening see you all over the weekend hopefully have a good one in the year 25, 25, just let's pause, Zager and Evans. Right, apologies, I'm back. Well, why am I back? I've already said to Ra once. Well, a very respected member of the scrapping community. Uh, I'm going to name him. I'm going to name him and shame him. E-Waste Mike. There you go. Named and shamed. It's not much of a shame, to be quite honest. But uh, I was on his live stream in the chat this afternoon. And he went, Ian Matthews. Now, that's another point. You know, come on, guys. My name's Ian. Oh, E-U-N, Ian. You know. You, you've known me for five years. He's Ian. E Ian. Man in this shed. You know, I keep saying it's Ian Matthews. You know, it's like very formal. Oh, Ian Matthews is in the chat. No, just say, Ian's in the chat. There's not many of us about Ian's. Unless you go to the old Anvil Yard. Then there's Big Ian, Little Ian, and me Ian, Old Ian. Oh, old. Anyway, back to Wee Ways, Mike and his constructive criticism he said uh, really Ian three minute video what's a gal supposed to do with that no he didn't say that he said uh, I barely got <laughs> straight face Early got time to get warmed up, he said. Stop it, stop it. Yes, uh, <clears throat> yes I am known for being long-winded videos, you know, yak, yak, yak. As my good mate Guido Wondelt says in German, blah, blah, blah. But enough said. So I thought <laughs> this short video, having edited it, I'd have to come back in the shed, put my clothes on to make it continuity-wise look right, and uh, pad it out a little. So here's a little bit of padding out. Forgive me. It's, it's just for you, Ace Mike. You know, you know. So, so first of all, you know, you can see we haven't actually drunk that much uh, cider tonight because it is only uh, uh, just gone half past eight so I've only been here an hour and a bit we have pulled our finger out we can see the bench as far as I can tell with me uh, swarf magnet yeah stick that in oh wiggle it around a bit and it picks up anything that's ferrous 
which means all those are stainless steel. No, you can't get things to stick up these days, can you? Right, off, off, off. Oh no, that's me. Uh, Ionizer that needs to be on. I need a green uh, orange light on that and off. Oh, it's all gone dark. Right, so back it. Oh, look at that walkway. It's more of a chicane than a walkway. So, just let me pause while I take a. I've got the right bottle in my hand, yes. Ah, right. To pad this out a bit, I want to discuss the little vagaries of life. Earlier, I had some gloves hanging up to dry. So I kind of stuck them in a pile. And I thought, right, okay, I'm going to do all that. Might as well put her, put her gloves on. And I've got one right hand, two right hands. Three right hands, four right hands, five right hands, pair of gloves. So why have I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 13, 40, 15 per, not per, why did they call it a per when it's only one, 15 left hand gloves and I've only, what did I say, half a dozen right hand gloves, so like 8 milli and 10 milli sockets, oh, would you like that little bit of shading, uh, that go missing in your shed, it seems that right hand gloves also go missing in my shed. Right, he wakes Mike. I hope I've padded this video out to a sufficient length that you will not feel disappointed by clicking on it, liking it, and of course, subscribing. He's in his shed. Tara again.